Greetings, programs. This is Wretch. Welcome back to Full Throttle Remastered. And we are still bike hunting, guys. We are looking for um, one of the cave fish to see if we can find some way to acquire, I guess, his mask or goggles to find the base. So, oh, speak of the devil. Now, we know that a lot of these weapons don't work. You know what? I'm going to try for Hacksaw Jim Duggan. Ho! Or ho! And there we go. Square to equip goggles. Oh wow, this is cool. That's a highway exit. Oh, this is trippy. The uh, exit or the controls are really delayed here. Oh, I don't want to slam into a wall. I assume it's going to let me know when I'm near the cave. Feel kind of like uh, Terminator or Predator Vision. Well, this is a cave, but not the cave we're looking for. Ooh. I think we might be on a track here. Because I am trying to control it, but... I think that's why the controls are fighting me. I'm actually not controlling it. Now, I'm going to assume that the cave is here and not on the highway. Maybe. I'm not sure. Oh! Oh! I took the exit! Crap. And now it doesn't... We don't have the goggles. Let's try that again. This time with a little less fail. And we will avoid those exit signs. And I hope that didn't just reset us. Because that would be a shame. We are heading into territory we haven't been before. And that really bugs me that they don't look both ways before crossing that <laughs> intersection. That's dangerous. That's an exit. We will avoid that. Cave. Nice. Okay, let's put the controller down. Back to mouse and keyboard. I don't spelunk. I don't spelunk. Okay, then what do you do? I don't spelunk. I guess we have to just keep on going. Oh wow, it's a fool style, uh cave, isn't it? That's interesting. With roads and everything. It's like a Mario Kart track. And there's our ramp. These guys are like Gollum. Or Deep Ones. Or something. Fortress. Everything about these guys is creepy. Oh, is that a castle? Yeah, it is. So they use this to uh, make the jump to get to their... And those are lasers? Huh. Property of the Ricky Myron Traveling Stunt Show. Well, that's ours.
I like how it automatically hitched up too. Well, let's just quietly get on our bike and go then? Yeah. Nope. Nope. I was mistaken. I'd better get out of here. I'd better get out of here. No, I, I need the ramp. I didn't have the ramp. There we go. We have to go back. I messed up, Ben. I'm sorry. It looked like it automatically uh, connected itself. And someone moved it back into place. Either that or the game was like, You weren't supposed to leave with it, you derp! Or without it. There we go. Now then... Do we connect it? There we go. Seems simple enough. Now can we leave? Alright. Let's not jackknife this thing. That would be unfortunate. I thought the game had just froze again. Oh lordy. I would have kept your goggles on there, sir. So how do we get around that? You know, I actually didn't check that one area that we couldn't hook a U in. What do we got here? Nada. Okay. So I'm not understanding what exactly we have to do here. Hmm. Well, let's get the ramp back into position. I think it might have something to do with these bumps in the road. Because the ramp was hitting against them as we were moving on, that might have been a clue. I'm not exactly sure what we, how we're going to remove them. Well, we do have a chainsaw and all that good stuff, so... Let's move along here. Yeah, see? It goes like that. Oh! We can actually move now. Possession is nine tenths of the law. Can we actually click on these things? No? Oh, oh, no, no, I don't want to do that. Can we. 
use the ramp somehow? Wow, really? Oh, I guess that makes sense because then they can't see where they're going anymore. They did notice the curve though? I'm done with these boys. The spirit of Ricky Myron. You know, you could have sold those. Alright. Now we got the booster and the hover lift. So we should be in good shape, I believe. Oh, wait a minute. I need to put the hover ramp on the bike, don't I? That would have been unfortunate. Looks okay for an aftermarket part. And now we just have... Yeah, we have all weapons now. Because when we got the booster, there was that little scene that said we automatically got it. So, dare we? Yellow. I guess we'll, we do it like this. I think we're gonna get some speed, maybe? Oh, controller. We'll go all the way here to the crash site. Because every time I've seen stunt driving, I know that we need to, uh... We need to get a lot of speed before we make any kind of jump. So here at the car, this seems like a good bit of distance. Okay. Now, if we just pull off to the side, that's going to be lame. <laughs> Let's hope for the best here, though. I'm staying off the uh, bumps. Just in case. Oh, lame. Lame, lame, lame. You're evil. Uh-huh. I thought that we'd be able to control it. Eh. Oh, Lord. That's what the hover booster's for. Okay, not bad. I'm glad we at least got to see the jump, though I wish we could have controlled it. So where to now? I guess that ominous reflection might be a clue. Looks like a Mad Max lair. But that is, uh... The motors, isn't it? Cool. This must be their one of their main factories. The Corley Motors factory. Holy ground. Hmm. Guess we go in. Ah, oop. We got a retaining wall, it looks like. I think we're just going to keep using the controller for right now, guys. That's some Star Wars Death Star drums right there. Looks like something big's going on in there. Really now? Souvenirs here. We got your hats. We got your pennants. We got it all right here. Come check it out. Corley's Toy Cars. New stuff. Hi. 
That's what happened. A regular job will do to you. <laughs> Official Corlett Motors merchandise. Right. <clears throat> what can I get you? Why are all the lights down here? We got a demolition derby tonight. First prize is a vintage curly hardtail, completely restored by the old man himself. Yep. What's this big arena doing way out here? Corley built the Smashatorium so his employees could have some wholesome entertainment nearby. He sure took care of his employees. I got no idea what's gonna happen to us now that he's gone. I'm looking for a good souvenir. Well, good souvenirs is all I got. What can I fix you up with? Little car? Hmm. Actually, let me think about it. He who hesitates goes home with Jack, and his kids hate him. Thanks for the warning. Seen any vultures around here? Nah, we don't have much of a vulture problem here, even though their hideout is right up the road. They stay pretty much locked up in there. Not very social. What's in the hat? I don't know. It ain't filled with it. Probably some sort of packing material. Packs a punch, I'll tell you that much. Ugh. <laughs> I don't know what kind of souvenir we need to get, though, so we'll leave that alone for right now. Better let you get back to work. All right, matey. Can we go? Drive your own derby car by remote control. Check out the demolition derby. Come with batteries included. And that must be the entrance. That's the old hardtail mole restored with Malcolm. Oh, wow. And that's first prize, so we know where Mo is for sure. Mo's here trying to get it back. It's the exit. It only spins one way, and it's the wrong way. Well, crap. That's not good. Um. Maybe let's see if we can go Lovable into. Lovable little bunny. Uh, the officially licensed bunny of the Corley Motors Smashatorium. We well, got your t shirts here. I know folks like that. They even talk just like it, too. Good folk, though. We got... Can we go around? So, obviously, the door's not going to be open. What is that? Just like the cell doors in Solitary. I'm here for the shareholders' meeting. Mr. Ripperger has postponed the meeting until Mr. Corley's murderers are apprehended. All the shareholders were notified. Yeah. Well, I haven't checked my voicemail lately, Mac. No. Oh, we can't punch? Or can hey, open up. Let me in. Beat it. Jerk. <laughs> I knew that probably wasn't going to work out, but... Let me in. Beat it. Jerk. Kick. Let me in. Beat it. Jerk. So most of our options have been utilized, except for the chainsaw. It looked like there was another way on the other side of the building. Let's go ahead and check that out. If you guys see that. Aha! Got a lot of junk here. Oh, no, no, no. And apparently I can't highlight that for... Oh, there it is. This foundation really needs some work. I'll beat it up later, when I have more time. It's sealed shut. It's closed. Hmm. This foundation really needs some work. Meters. Wow, this place sucks up the juice. Can we keep on going? No, we can't. Okay. 
Those weapons were about a week. Oh, we lost all of our stuff. Are you kidding me? I'm saving that chain for my friends on the old mine road. That's unfortunate. Well, maybe we can use the uh, tire iron. It's meant for nuts. It's meant for nuts. Interesting. So we got the car. I wonder if we can go check out the vulture's lair. And not the one from uh, Spider-Man Homecoming. Let's see. We'll make the drive and see. Looks like Snake Mountain. And we've got... There's the Vulture's hideout on the other side of this field. I've heard a lot about the vultures. And I guess it's all true. Gotcha. So walking across that would be bad. That's okay though, because now would be a good time to get a souvenir maybe? Go get an adorable bunny or a car and uh, send those across the minefield. I think that might work out. Let's go ahead and give it a look-see. All sizes and colors. Fill our handy beverage hats with your drink of choice. Okay. <clears throat> what can I get you? I'm looking for a good souvenir. Well, good souvenirs is all I got. What can I fix you up with? The little car. Extra bunnies and plenty of them. Bunnies and plenty of them. You want bunnies? I got your bunnies. How much you got on you? Uh, can I just take them out for a test drive? I think you may not be ready for the kind of commitment that comes with a Corley Bunny value pack. Sorry, son. Okay. Those uh, shirts come in extra, extra large. Eh. No, but they're pretty shrunk. No thanks. What do those pennants say on them? Can't beat a Corley, they say. Kind of ironic, actually, considering how he died. Still, look great on your bedroom wall. No walls. My bike is my home. We could set you up with a little pole so you could uh, make a flag, you know, for your back seat. I'll uh, think about it. How about that little car there? It's small, but it's not cheap, my friend. You better just take it for a test drive to make sure. Oh, awesome. Something small, furry, and yellow. Sorry, this is the only set of teeth I got. <laughs> Dang, there goes another one. Do you actually have any money? As much as I need. Looky here. Nothing personal, but why don't you mosey along and stop scaring away all the other customers, all right? Just clearing my throat. Okay, so we can uh, you, big fella. Come give our derby car a spin. Take this for a souvenirs to remind you of your special Smashatorium adventure. Sure, sure. Take it for a spin. Just don't go out of range. Buy your kids a bunny okay. so they'll shut up on the long drive home. Looks like it's getting weak. Oh great, you killed the batteries. Hmm. Alright, well, we killed the batteries already. Cheap, that didn't take Buy long. Something. All right, let's see the cash, amigo. I'll owe you. No bucks, no yucks, compadre. So if we need we to get money it, somehow. <laughs> Probably getting into the demolition derby, I, I would the assume. Button. You know you want to. Let's try using our. I'd like to wrap this around Rip Burger's neck. It's meant for nuts. Okay, how about the chain? 
I'm saving that chain for my f It's meant for nuts. Can we grab this? Mm. No. We can't take the sign down. All right, guys. Well, um, we do have a lot to do. We just got to figure what order to do it in. So I'll go ahead and end it here, and we'll pick it up next time. Hope you guys have enjoyed it. If you liked the episode, please leave a like down below. Subscribe to the channel. Leave a comment. That'd be a big help. And we'll see you next time. Later days, everyone. <laughs>